Hello, I'm uh, Patrick with uh, Just Ponics, and today I want to talk to you about um, using our EduKit to turn your 10 gallon aquarium tank into an aquaponic system. So, first off, I want to describe some of the materials that you'll need to construct an EduKit. You can either buy it from us or construct your own. So, first, you'll need a bucket. There's a plastic bucket. You'll need a bell siphon. We print these ourselves. You can find us on Amazon and Etsy. You'll need a bucket of grow media, such as Hydrotone. There's a bucket of Hydrotone. A pump. And a drill. And the two drill bits you'll need are a 7 eighths um, hole saw and a 1 fourth inch drill bit. So now, I'm going to uh, turn this bucket into a aquaponics grow bed for your 10 gallon aquarium. The first thing you'll need to do is take your 7 8 hole saw. And drill a hole somewhere in your bucket. This 7 8 hole is for the bell siphon. So let me drill this hole. So there's the hole. Next thing you'll need to drill is a hole for the, the line from the pump. So take your 1 4 inch drill bit, drill another hole somewhere into the bucket. hole for the pump holes. And now we're gonna take all these uh, materials and convert our 10 gallon aquarium into aquaponic system. Hello, now we're gonna take our, our uh, Just Ponics EduKit and we're gonna convert our 10 gallon aquarium into an aquaponic system. So first thing you wanna do is take your, your bucket with the seven eighth eight inch hole and screw in your bell siphon. So the Just Ponics auto, the bell siphon comes with a O-ring and you wanna put that O-ring onto the bell siphon, push it through the seven eighth, eight inch hole and take this nut and screw it into place. This O-ring will prevent water from leaking from the top of the bucket to the bottom of the bucket. And it'll only allow it to come through this tube. Next, you wanna take your S-shaped connector and screw it in on the bottom. This is for the drainage. Okay. So now you have the kit ready. Now, Take your pump and stick it into your aquarium. Let's do this right now. Once you have your pump in your aquarium, you want to take uh, get some type of a uh, way to keep your aquaponics grow bed on top of the aquarium. You could have you could have your aquarium on a shelf and put this uh, grow bed on top of the shelf, or you can even use two blocks of wood as a base for the aquaponics system. So just put the two pieces of wood there. Keep your aquaponics uh, bucket right on top. Take the hose that you just that's coming out of your your pump and stick it into the a hole in the, the grow bucket. Okay. 
add in your hydrotone or other inert media. Finally, turn on your pump. Plug in your pump. So you'll see the water from the aquarium being pumped into this grill bucket. And as the water rises, once it heat, reaches the top of the bell siphon, this bell siphon will siphon all the water in the bucket back into the pump. So the benefits of this aquaponics grow bed on top is that you can actually use it as a filter for your fish tank. In addition, you can grow other uh, plants up here. You can grow uh, herbs, you can grow uh, wheatgrass, you can grow uh, tomatoes. <laughs> so you can actually turn your aquarium into a mini grow bed. And let's see this auto siphon work. This is the auto siphon right here. So when the auto siphon starts working, you'll see the water flush from the bottom of the siphon. There we go, the siphon just started. Once the siphon starts, you'll see the water slowly drain from the top of the, the bucket. This constant filling of the bucket and the draining of the bucket uh, provides good aeration for any plant plants that you de decide to plant in the, the grow bucket. So this is how you turn a 10 gallon aquarium fish tank into aquaponic system. And if you want this kit or the bell siphon, you can go to our Etsy page or Amazon page. So visit us at justponics.com. Bye.